A person from the Khawarij claimed that Ali alayhi salam had committed oppression for killing the Khawarij in the Battle of Nehrawan. He would say, I will seek out anyone who can prove to me that Ali alayhi salam was not an oppressor. Thus, Imam Bakir alayhi salam was introduced to him. He then gathered a group of his companions and visited the Imam. After the Imam's words and the enumeration of Hazrat Ali alayhi salam's virtues by his companions, the man stood up and said, I am more aware of Ali's virtues than those in this gathering. But all that is related to before he accepted the arbitration. But after the arbitration, he became a disbeliever. The discussion on Ali alayhi salam's virtues reached the hadith of Khaybar in which the Holy Prophet salam said, Tomorrow I will hand the flag to a person who loves God and His Messenger, and God and His Messenger also love him. He charges the enemy and never escapes from the battlefield. Imam Bakr salam asked, What do you think about this hadith? The man replied, the hadith is true, but Ali's disbelief was after this. Imam said, On the day that God loved Ali, did he know that he would kill the people of Narawan in the future or not? If I say that he did not know, I will become a disbeliever. So he knew. Imam continued, was God's love for Ali alayhi salam because he was moving in the line of obedience to God or was it because of disobedience? The man said, It is clear that God's friendship was due to Ali's servitude and obedience. Imam Bakir alayhi salam replied, Now you have been defeated in the debate. Get up and leave the assembly. Because God's love for Ali shows that Ali will walk on the path of obedience to God until the end of his life and will not deviate from the path of his pleasure. And what he did in narrow one was according to his divine duty. The man got up and said, Allah knows best where to place his apostleship.